Hi, welcome to this edition of Investment Insights. Today, I have Leah Keys with me. Welcome, Leah. Hi, Tatiana. How have the markets performed throughout the first quarter of 2021? Global share markets continued their strong run over the quarter, responding positively to the speed of vaccine rollouts and sizeable central bank stimulus, as it meant economies are likely to reopen quicker and corporate earnings would improve. Sectors like industrials, financials and energy, which lagged throughout 2020, experienced a turnaround in this environment, outperforming the likes of technology stocks, which had dominated during the stay-at-home period. Bond markets finished the quarter in negative territory as interest rates increased on the back of increased inflation expectations. And what did this mean for our funds? This meant that our investment options with more growth assets like shares experienced higher returns. For example, on the screen you can see how our growth funds have performed compared with our more defensive funds which have a higher allocation to bonds and cash. Over the longer term, all the investment options are performing well. What trends do we see looking forward into 2021? Looking forward, we're expecting to see strong economic growth across the globe, but with variations between economies. The speed of vaccine rollouts will dictate the level of openness of economies, which coupled with stimulus will boost spending and growth, providing a positive backdrop for investments. Locally, we have seen the opening of the Trans-Tasman bubble, and there are other examples of reopenings, but the tourism sector still has a long way to go to recover. Overall, we are cautiously optimistic, but are expecting a volatile environment as the world attempts to return their economies back to normal.